In 1984, a sole inventor escaped with the temporal displacement unit. An invention able to displace an occupant to any date in time. During the course of this adventure, he met up with his old friend Edward. Together they struggled against the elusive time agents, who were scheming to change time. In the year 2014, the two friends were forced to a last stand against the time agents. This is what followed. Hey, are you awake? Hello. Answer, hello. Shut it. My head. I'm sorry buddy. Well, now we are in a fix. What happened? I don't remember either. Only thing I know is I woke up in this cell. Where are we? Seems to be like a makeshift prison. Let us hope we are not too far from town. When are we? I can't tell. I guess our time, maybe. Though I really don't recall this place. What about the car? I am sure they did not just leave it. It is probably well guarded right now. How do we escape? Well, lucky me. I picked the guard's key. Is there any opening on your side? Yes, there is. All right, let me throw it to you. I said be quiet. All right, that's it. Quick, open the door with the key. Do you think you can take it up with me? Okay, Doc. That was great. Ah, my stuff. Okay, Doc. Let's get out of here. What is that? Is that my dimensional box? Oh, come on, Doc. Yes, it is. Okay. Let's get out of here. No way out through the entrance. Ha, huh, to the left. I know a way. Okay. To the sewers, quick. So. So what? We better move quick, before they get find of us missing. Do you know how to navigate here? As a youngling, I used to venture into the sewers. So, ready. Do you have a spare flashlight? You are lucky, yes, I always keep my trusty flashlight with me. That's great. Alright. These sewers are so creepy. You must be so brave to roam around here. Aha! There is a way out. Alright, this is the exit to the bridge. I give you the honor. Okay, Doc. Thank you. Quick, follow me. What? What is this? How do I know? I'm with you from the beginning. What happened here? Must be the wrong year. I wonder, one is certain, I bet the time machine is in that high building, they may be using it already for their plans. Let us get it then. We can't simply walk in there, it is likely well guarded. We must get in. We just escaped, we cannot just walk up to them and ask if we can enter. We take the sewers. If we get caught again, I bet you that it won't be as easy next time around. What is that? You hear it? There is something coming towards us on that direction. Doc incoming. What are you still doing there? Come on Doc. Quick. Let's go. Alright. To the sewers, quick. That's what I told you before.
There is no other way then. Told yet. Boogers, I don't remember this blockade. Let us take the long way around. Okay, Doc. Oh no, those guys are bad. No, 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 you need to be dead. You are not an exception, dude. That's it. Don't ever mess with us again. Two ways. Harg. What do we do? I don't know. You say. We will have to split ways. You know this never goes well. This is not a movie pal, come on, you take the left, I take the one straight up. Let us stick together. Alright lead the way. Okay doc. Let's go. Where did you go? Ah. There you are. What the? What was that? Come on doc. Wait for me. Don't leave me alone. Hey, I see something over there. Where are you going? I'm just giving you the honor, bud. Okay. That's a sign of a trouble. Oh. I see a guy in here, Doc. Hmm. This place is so strange. And what is that machine over there? Hey. Who are you? Just some guys. Oh really? Just some guy? Well I wonder because, you look like one of those who got taken away by the agents. Don't worry, we won't give you away. Thank you. Can you just tell me why they put you in there in the first place? And how did you escape? It's a long story. Edward picked the keys. Who is Edward? He is right behind me. Alright then. No issues there. We could need a couple of hands here. We lost something to them. Well, the only way to get them is barred. What do you mean? The floodgates, which allowed us to enter into the town without being seen have been sealed magnetically. No way around it. We tried it with force but these doors are too thick. So there is no way out then? Unless you guys got any ideas, you would not be able to enter. The doors are too strong, you said. I could figure something out. All I need would be hard to get by. You guys don't have a magnetometer and a microwave? Do you? We got a microwave but we don't have a magnetometer around. They are illegal. So, is there an illegal way to get it? Yes there is one. Michael, no, we don't even know them. They may be play acting spies for all we know. I give you my word. We won't. Listen Jason, I know this makes no sense but I have a feeling it is the right thing to trust them. If you really need a magnetometry you can ask him to get it. You need a second man anyways. Speak with Jason if you are ready. Afterwards you can help your friend with his idea. Whatever he needs a microwave for. Do you have a resources to spare? To the left you can find our cook. He can give you a daily ration. Other than that, you can buy more if needed. Okay. Thanks Michael. Okay. So. He must be the Jason. Let's save the game first. Oh.